Ba -da -ba -da -ba -ba. What's good, guys? Man or Country Salty? You hope you're doing well. Man, I had so much good feedback from the last Matchbox 20 song. Everybody said, you gotta do another one, gotta do another one. And I usually do, he played what Wednesdays, but I thought I'd switch it up on a Tuesday. I'll do another little Matchbox 20, because these are easy to play, and it's going to be about four chords. G, C, E minor, D. If you want a lesson where you just see those four chords, I type in Matt McCoy, first four chords. If I RST, first four chords, you'll see a close-up of how I play every one of these. Said I don't know if I've ever been good enough. I'm a little bit rusty and I think my head is caving in. And I don't know if I've ever been really loved. My hand that's touched me and I feel something's got to give. A little bit angry. Good little jam there, guys. Let's start with the chorus. Uh, lock on the two bottom strings for a G. Yes. All I did there is go G for two, then down, keep the bottom two like that, that set third string for bottom four, D for two, then when I say C, it's a C at nine, again. Fourth and fifth, strung the bottom five. C for two, D for two. We're gonna do it twice, it goes up. I wanna push you around, and I will, and I will. I wanna push you down, and I will, and I will. Now, this last little bar, go to your final chord of E minor. So, get the bottom two lock, press right between that fifth and fourth. I wanna take you for granted. So, instead of a G, you want an E minor, so E minor, D. A little jam to play. So again, so you're gonna do a G D C D, G D C D, then then the E minor. So let me play it, kind of normal speed, but uh, slow down a little bit. Because uh, I wanna push you around. Yeah, I will. The uh, verse, same thing, you're going to go G to D, E minor, C. Well, remember, it's always a two count. Strumming is about timing, so more than going down, up, down, up, whatever. Focus on that that, that counts, per, that pattern. I don't know if I've ever been really enough. See, it does, it goes. I don't know if I've ever been good enough. A little bit rusty and I think my head's key. Go around there four times, G, D, E minor, C, four times. And then on that little pre-chorus, you're going to start, start with that D. Oh, well, this ain't over, not here, it's going to see.
go to that. Uh, my, my camera's falling here. So you can go to D to C, D to C, and then D. Like I said, strumming's all about timing, guys. Make sure you do those down strums. So even when I say a two count, I'm, I'm saying one, two, one, two, one, two, one. But after you get more and more comfortable with that timing, you can go maybe like. So that's how you that's how you evolve as 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 far as with your strumming. I've got a strumming DVD on my website, uh, countrysongteach.com. Make sure you go get that if you struggle with strumming, because it's all about learning within that timing what you can do. So once you know it's a two count time, always just always say do it, mess it up, improve it. Do it, mess it up, improve it. So start out with just that basic strumming, and then get a little more, a little fancier. Because strumming, strumming sounds, sounds better to me when you can mix it up. Instead of just one strumming pattern, so maybe. For example, when I go on that D chord, keep your first finger off the third string and first strum it, and then put it on. You hear that? So it's good. Wow, wow, wow. So it's like on that C, take your first finger off that fourth string. So even though I'm saying go to the C chord, I'm not, <coughs> excuse me, I'm going into it without the first finger. So watch me kind of like lag this first finger on G. So G lag. Is what's called musical dimension. Sounds pretty cool, doesn't it? guys hey let me know if there's any kind of out of box out of the box when i say out of the box like non-country song if there's a non-country song you've been wanting to learn a lot now let me know like a little like Check out my website, guys, countrysongteacher.com. All one word, countrysongteacher.com. All the links are in the bio. Uh, I've got four chord song books, new stuff, prime country song books, um, strumming DVDs, guitar DVDs, all that, piano DVDs, all that good stuff. So be sure to go check it out after you smash the like button for the good old YouTube algorithm. We'll see what we can make it happen. All right, guys. Love y'all. Until next time. Let's go.